kids, if you're giving interviews to policemen and, and investigators, it's highly likely you don't need to go and then talk about it online. You probably need to chill out until the investigation has gone on a little while longer. And anything that you feed needs to be fed to the cops, to the investigators, and not to, like, everyone. But since we're getting the information, let's officer, I did work with convicted felons. I did supervised murders. I have dealt with the worst of the worst. So a lot of this I pick up on this well. interesting, isn't it? Adventures with Purpose are, are like they're taking on this case and they rarely ever look at fresh cases. So they're actually going to look into this case. And the first thing I said when she disappeared was, where's the closest body of water? And are these teens watching these recovery sites on, on the internet? Are these teens watching what these people do, how they do it, so that they think that they're getting away with something because I really do honestly believe while there may have been a mature hand in this, I believe that it was this was probably a younger crime. I think something, whatever has been done, was done by a younger person. They may have had an older person feeding them information or guidelines, but I think it was predominantly done by younger people. That's what I'm picking up the vibe I'm getting from it. And are they just arrogant enough to think that they are getting all this information from the Internet? And so they've watched all these different agencies. So they know how to maneuver and manipulate so that and they can avoid obstacles, avoid getting caught and, and you know, be able to do these things. And because I'm picking up on a very arrogant undertone with these kids. Hey everybody, here's some stuff that I found interesting. This is a video by Project Veritas that came out earlier in 2022 during the sheriff's race in Placer County, California, where Wang Wu was vying for sheriff, but they had determined that Devin Bell, the previous sheriff, had not handled a uh, investigation properly due to um, allegations of statutory rape by candidate Wang Wu. Now, you can go read how this ended. Apparently, he is he won the sheriff's race, so he was, doesn't have a criminal charge against him, um, and the previous sheriff retired due to health issues, and it seems like everything kind of died down and went on, just as life kind of does, it faded away. Please go watch this link, I will put it in the descriptions by Project Veritas. It's just interesting information that I thought you all might want to look at. Um, the allegations are that it was reported he was having an underage relationship. He stated he did have a relationship. Uh, they did an internal investigation, which is against the law. It should have been an external investigation, which kind of got them in a lot of hot water, made people question it. Uh, then it was said, oh, well, we found out she was over 18 the whole time, so there really was no need for this, and it kind of disappeared into the night. Does it seem like maybe all the I's were dotted and all the T's were crossed? But you know how these things occur and these things happen. So, you know, just go get the full story, do your own research, and understand the dynamic that potentially was at play here. That is for you to decide. I did look up and see who is the current acting sheriff, and it is Wayne Wu. He is the sheriff of Plaster County. Uh, he is um, the current sheriff, and if you want to look at who is currently on his staff, you can click on the link and see those that are working beneath him. And you see basically everybody except for the bean dude. And I'm trying to research and see exactly what happened there um, because I'm confused. But anyway, I did also find this. So um, people were reporting on the story and it kind of got lost in the shuffle. So there was enough internal interest within the community that they were concerned greatly about the story and the implications that teenagers were being, uh, you know, had inappropriate contact with um, Sheriff Department staff and that something was strange.